My dog is going nuts. So this is Pascal. Hi everyone. Anyway, I haven't filmed a beauty related video in quite some time and now's the perfect time because it is the Sephora VIB Rouge so embarrassing um, spring social. So they're offering 15% off of purchases until I believe April 10th and so I went ahead and made a few purchases. I actually went once with my friend Alianka and we snagged a couple of goodies and then I went back today to pick up a few more things and so I'm going to show you what I got here. The two products that I am obsessed with at the moment are these Bite let me see what they're called. I know it's their matte, matte cream lip crayon. And the one that I'm wearing right now is in the shade Clementine. And these are just so pigmented and also very creamy. I find that they don't dry nearly as much as other lipsticks. It does a tiny, tiny bit, but for the most part, it's very moisturizing. And I've been really obsessed with orange and purple and all things makeup recently. So I got the shade Clementine and Grape. I'll swatch them for you so you can see, but I am wearing the Clementine right now. And they are so pretty. I kind of want them all. I think they're limited edition too, so, but here you are. Here's Grape and Clementine, and Grape is actually not as purple as you would think, but also my lips are very pigmented, so maybe that's why it doesn't seem like, bam, purple in your face, but I'm obsessed with them. Two thumbs up, and maybe I'll do a beauty review on those guys. And if there's like one brand that I am obsessed with from Sephora, it has to be NARS. I'm sorry, I'm going to keep looking over here at this little bugger. Um, and so I wanted, I have their blushes, like a little blush set, and then I also have Sin, which I have been loving. And I wanted, like I said, I'm obsessed with orange right now, so I wanted something a little more orange pinky tone. So I picked up the shade Torrid, which is really pretty. It's actually a little peachy orange or in person. Um, I actually have this on today as well to go with the rest of the look. So this is something I've been loving. They stay on pretty good all day and they're much more pigmented than a lot of um, other items that I, other blushes that I've used. So I really love NARS. And I just picked this up on a whim. It's not even something that I went in for to be honest with you. Um, but I picked up this really gorgeous eyeshadow palette and I think it's called Kauai, and I this might be limited edition or from a more recent collection because it was kind of like off on its own. And it's just this gorgeous purple tone color, and I'll swatch those too. I haven't even used this yet, so I'm excited. But here are the two colors right there for you. It doesn't seem nearly as pretty on camera as it is on in person, but here, there, that's a lot better. Um, so yeah, I got this guy here and also a bunch of eyeliners because I am feeling pretty experimental and I got this Stila smudge stick waterproof eyeliner in turquoise and I want to do something super fun with this eyeliner. And then I've been obsessed with these Sephora, what are the name of these, crayon contour eye pencil 12 hour wear waterproof eyeliners and I've been using these I have like a bunch of metallic shades which I will feature at some point probably in my favorites for the month of March um, I've been obs obsessed with these and the metallics I've used to line my waterline just to open up the eyes a bit more and they really stay put they're gorgeous so I decided to pick up this really pretty blue and it's like a cobalt blue and then a purple as well because I want to start experimenting a little more and have a little fun this spring and summer also, one last thing that I have, oh no, a couple more things. I picked up a little Glam glam Glow Youth Mud Tingle Exfoliate Treatment, and I've tried this before, um, and it was a little harsh for me to use on a regular basis, but my skin's been breaking out. It's been like really freaking out recently, so I wanted to just try something like to use as more of a spot treatment or in the areas where I really need it. I use the Glam Glow, the moisturizing mask, and that is incredible. And a little, seriously, a little tiny bit goes such a long way because I know it's expensive, but I've used mine so many times and it's pretty much full still. So that says a lot. So I picked up this little guy. Hopefully that'll help. And then, of course, I picked up a Pro Prime Smudge 
proof eyeshadow base from NARS because this is like the best eyeshadow primer ever. Like hands down, it does not crease. And now that it's starting to warm up, kind of, in New York City, I don't know what's the deal this year, but it's kind of starting to get warmer here. I wanted to pick something that just would help my eyeshadow stay put and this does not budge. So awesome. So yeah, that's it for my Sephora haul. I actually have two more nail polishes on the way, which is like a minty, I think it's called Illusion, like a minty green, and then also like a pretty purple. I can't think of the name of it, but they're coming and I'm excited and yeah, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this little haul and if you have shopped recently at Sephora for the spring social, please let me know what you guys got because I would love to check out some new products. Not that I need them, but yeah. All right, guys. Have a good one. Bye.